pain is an inevitable thread, weaving through the fabric of our lives. It comes in many forms, heartbreak, disappointment, loss, and failure. Yet in the crucible of hardship, there exists a transformative alchemy, a profound ability to turn pain into power. Imagine pain not as an adversary to be conquered, but as a raw material, waiting to be sculpted into strength and resilience. In the grand theater of life, we often find ourselves playing the lead role in a tragedy. The weight of sorrow and the sting of failure can be overwhelming. However, buried beneath the surface of our struggles lies the untapped potential for growth and empowerment. Turning pain into power is a delicate dance, a choreography of the mind and spirit that requires both courage and creativity. Consider for a moment the image of a phoenix rising from the ashes. The phoenix, a mythical bird of ancient lore, is said to burst into flames upon death, only to be reborn from its own ashes. In the crucible of pain, we too can experience a metaphorical rebirth. Our challenges, failures and heartaches become the very ashes from which we rise, stronger and more resilient than before. Let's look into the analogy of failures as building bricks and small wins as the building frame. Picture your journey as the construction of a magnificent castle. Failures, those seemingly insurmountable obstacles, are the building bricks that lay the foundation. Each failure, like a carefully laid brick, contributes to the strength and solidity of your castle. Instead of viewing failures as stumbling blocks, See them as essential components of the grand design, shaping the fortress of your character. Now imagine the small winds as the building frame, the skeletal structure upon which the walls and towers will rise. These are the moments of triumph, no matter how seemingly insignificant. They are the beams and columns that support the weight of your aspirations. Embrace each small win, for in doing so, you reinforce the very structure of your being. Whether it's a successful project, a personal achievement, or a moment of self-discovery, these victories are the scaffolding that propels you forward. As you lay the bricks of failure and erect the frame of small winds, you begin to see the emergence of a castle, a symbol of your strength and resilience. The pain that once threatened to engulf you becomes the cornerstone of your power. It's a testament to your ability to not only weather the storm, but to harness its energy for positive transformation. Consider the story of Thomas Edison, the prolific inventor whose numerous failures could have easily snuffed out his spirit. Instead, he saw each failure as a stepping stone towards success. In his quest to create the electric light bulb, Edison famously remarked, I have not failed, I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. His castle of creativity and innovation was built on the bricks of perseverance and the frame of unwavering determination. Turning pain into power is not a passive process. It's an active, intentional choice. It requires a shift in perspective, a willingness to embrace the inherent wisdom within our struggles. Like an artist turning a blank canvas into a masterpiece, you have the power to shape your narrative. The brush strokes of pain can be transformed into strokes of resilience, creating a motif of triumph over adversity. In this alchemical process, self-reflection becomes the crucible where pain is transmuted into power. Take the time to understand the lessons embedded in your challenges. What strengths have you discovered in the face of adversity? How have your failures become the raw materials for future success? As you contemplate these questions, you become the architect of your own destiny, designing a castle fortified with the wisdom gleaned from your experiences. Consider the Japanese art of Kintsugi, where broken pottery is mended with lacquer mixed with powdered gold, silver or platinum. The resulting piece is not only functional, but also a work of art, celebrating the beauty of imperfection. 
Similarly, as you mend the fractures of your own journey with the golden threads of resilience, your life becomes a masterpiece, an intricate mosaic of strength and vulnerability. Turning pain into power is also about reclaiming your narrative. Rather than allowing your hardships to define you, seize the pen and become the author of your story. The pages of your life are not limited to moments of pain. They are also filled with the triumphs, the joys, and the small victories that shape your character. In rewriting your story, you become the hero who rises from the ashes, the architect of a castle built on the foundation of resilience. The journey of turning pain into power is a profound and enchanting expedition. Embrace failures as the building bricks that fortify your foundation and relish the small wins as the building frame that shapes the castle of your strength. In the crucible of life, transform pain into power through intentional self-reflection and a courageous shift in perspective. Your narrative is a canvas waiting to be painted, a castle waiting to be built, one that stands not in spite of pain, but because of it. I hope this journey has sparked a flame within you, a flame that illuminates the transformative potential within your own adversities. Life's struggles are not roadblocks, they are stepping stones to resilience, strength, and self-discovery. I invite you to take a moment, right here and now, to reflect on your own journey. What bricks of failure have you laid, and how have they contributed to the foundation of your strength? What small wins have formed the frame of your personal castle, reinforcing your character and propelling you forward? The beauty of this process lies not just in the stories I've shared, but in the unique narrative each of you carries. Your comments are the brushstrokes that add depth and color to this collective canvas of self-realization. Share your thoughts, your struggles, and your triumphs in the comments below. Let this space be a sanctuary for self-reflection and a source of inspiration for others who may be navigating their own transformative path. If this journey resonated with you, if you felt a connection with the idea of turning pain into power, consider hitting that like button. It's not just a click, it's a symbol of solidarity, a recognition that we are all architects of our own castles, crafting resilience from the raw materials of our experiences. And if you haven't already, I encourage you to subscribe. Join this community of individuals on a shared quest for empowerment and self-discovery. Let's build a virtual fortress of support where each subscriber adds a brick to the collective strength of our community. Thank you for watching this video. May your path be adorned with the golden threads of resilience and may your castle stand tall, a testament to the power within you. Until we meet again, keep turning your pain into power and let the symphony of your strength resonate across the vast landscape of your life.